Space Station Meteor, presented by Science at NASA. On August 12th and 13th, Earth passed through a stream of debris from Comet Swift-Tuttle, source of the annual Perseid meteor shower. Around the world, millions of people watched bunches of bright and colorful Perseids streak across the moonlit sky, but only six people saw the shower from above. High above Earth's surface, circling the planet at 17,000 miles per hour, the crew of the International Space Station watched the shower too. This is what a shooting star looks like from space, tweeted Expedition 28 flight engineer Ron Guerin, who photographed a bright Perseid streaking beneath the space station. At the time of the shot, 1917 Universal Time on August 13th, the ISS was over China, moving from the Gobi Desert near the Mongolian border toward Beijing. This isn't the first time astronauts have seen and photographed meteors underfoot, but this could be the most beautiful shot to date. In my opinion, this is the finest still image of a meteor from the International Space Station or any spacecraft, says Bill Cook, director of NASA's Meteoroid Environment Office. Good catch, Ron. Cook has analyzed the image. Based on the meteor's apparent brightness, he believes Garin caught a nugget of comet debris about one centimeter in diameter, hitting the atmosphere at 132,000 miles per hour. The astronomical magnitude of the meteor was about negative three, very nearly a fireball, says Cook. Other objects of interest in the photo include the orange giant star Arcturus, brightest member of the constellation Boötes, the herdsman, Corona Borealis, the northern crown, Serpens, the serpent, solar panels of the International Space Station, and a Soyuz spacecraft docked to the space station, a layer of green airglow. Airglow comes from atoms and molecules in Earth's upper atmosphere, which are excited by sunlight during the day. At night, they release their energy as a green band of light visible from orbit. Cook is convinced. Next year, he says, I want to watch the Perseids from orbit too. For more information about things you can see from space, visit science.nasa.gov.